Hey viewers, your favorite gay gamer here again, and I've got some gay gaming news for you. That's right. Ooh, floating air. Yeah, there's a guy standing on the other side of that, and he's just like, Oh my god, it's, it must be a ghost. I don't know why the ale's floating, what the hell? He's kind of a moron. But, um... Skyrim has been confirmed to have gay romances. And not just gay romances, but gay marriages. I am very happy at this news, because this makes... I, it makes me glad I pre-ordered the game, I'll say that. It makes me very glad. But, um... Oh, you're dead! Continue. Oh, who's laughing now? I got manly, monstrous strength, apparently. Dun, dun, dun. What was I say? Oh, yeah. Um, Skyrim has been confirmed to have gay romances. Not just gay romances, but gay marriages. You can <laughs> gay marriage has been legalized in Skyrim. You can marry, could have various benefits depending on who you marry, yada yada, but I'm really glad to see that they decided to include that in the game. But I will include the link down below, thank you, to where you can uh, read up about this yourself. Stop right there! Never! What's the matter? Getting tired! What's the matter? Getting tired! Yeah! Ah. I'm in trouble. We can talk about this. Ah, I'm out of here. Oh my god, there's been a murder. What's happened here? Quickly, my fellow guards, rally to me. I'm not going that way again. But yeah, so for anyone else who's excited about these things, you know, leave a comment. Be like, I'm looking forward to this. This is awesome. Oh my god. Oh my, oh my god. Oh my god. Oh god, I made him so ugly. And now we're back, viewers, just like I promised, in Mass Effect. Yes, my character's horrendously ugly, I know. Gives him a sense of style. So, the other news I had for you. Part two of the news. Hello, oh shit. Commander Shepard. The other news I have for you is that gay romance has been confirmed in Mass Effect 3 as well. But then they're Bioware. Almost every single one of their games has gay romance. Oh shit, I wasn't paying attention. I could not have done it without you. I don't know what I'm... Ah! They're not done yet. I killed them because they deserve it. Now I'm placing you under arrest. But, um, as I was supposed to be talking about, and I'm probably going to have to splice this video now, Mass Effect 3 confirmed to have gay romance. Oh, yes. This is a great, this is really a great year for, uh, for gay gamers, gotta say. I don't know in what way they will entail, but I will include the link to the confirmations, just like I did with Skyrim. Although, really, if you play these games, you'll be amazed that you didn't see it before if you played Female Shepherd, which I didn't. But I have a lot of friends who are like, what? They were already there. Female Shepherd was all over that. She was like, om nom nom. If anybody doesn't understand that, good. I shouldn't have even said it. Oh, they're dead. Finally, they're freaking jerks. Well, you can probably guess what I'm going to say next, viewers. Same gender romance arcs with companions has been confirmed in the Old Republic MMO. Fuck yes. Took a lot of pushing, a lot of back and forth, but they have confirmed it. It will be a post-launch feature, but it will be in the game. Very excited about this. Very, very excited. What's on your mind? So I figured I would show you all this little mod I created while I'm talking about it. But, um... It, it, I find it kind of silly they held off for two years without saying shit to us, but I am glad they went this route. But, you know, it's... It, it's Bioware. Pretty much all of their games have that stuff. Pretty much, I mean, is it really any surprise? I'm all ears, beautiful. Which, the fact that I'm all ears, or the beautiful part? I might consider it, but what are you going to call me in exchange? That's right. I've made a mod that makes Karth sexable, yes, sir. What's what I'm looking for? Romanceable. 
I call it Gorsham's Gay Carth. Or G.G. Carth. I like the first part of that. I'm a bit more partial to the most handsome pilot in the galaxy. Well, what do you think? Well, then, I guess gorgeous will just have to do until then, won't it? No, but kidding aside, I bet you're not about to give up on those questions of yours. Are they really necessary? But, um... You know, the romance talks with companions definitely a good portion of the game. And by good portion, I don't mean it's like, oh, it's gonna take as long as leveling and questing and raiding, but it's a significant side feature that you can take part in. You know, kind of like in these, the KOTOR games, or any other game. If you played a Bioware game, you know how romance arcs work. There's, there's nothing really different this time around. Let's do that. Leave me alone. I'm trying to address my viewers. Okay, so as I said, I will post a link to the, uh, you know, the dev post where they're like, confirmation. And, uh, oh, well, I'm gonna Problem. steal from them. Got it. Skyrim, Mass Effect 3, The Old Republic, all confirmed to have uh, homosexual content. This is a fantastic year for gay gamers. And uh, I don't know about you, but I'm gonna be playing all of them. Pudu, Tony Rama, Napraka, Donko, Tsercha, Chupa Punky. Yeah. I don't know what the hell I just said. I don't know what the hell I just said. As always, there will be more. And this has been Gorsham's Gaming News. The first ever edition, possibly the last. I don't know. I just make news thingies when I'm interested in something, and I'm like, oh my god, I'm going to share it with those guys. Why am I sharing it with those guys? I don't know. Why am I talking in this voice? Oh my god. Um... So yeah, seriously though, I'm really glad to see all this stuff in in uh, Skyrim, Mass Effect 3, The Old Republic. It's really good to see. So, until next time, I am out of here. Hi, Karth. I'm going to stand close to Karth and then I'm out of here. Don't turn your back on me. Don't you do it. Ah, oh, you are such a virgin, virgin. There we go. Yes, what's on your mind? See ya.